Hi everyone, Thomas here and welcome back to another video. So today I'm back here for another creator sim and here we have a sim called Tina Meadows. Now, I'm going to tell you a little bit about her backstory. Uh, first of all, she's a single parent, which, you know, is really, really, just well, she's struggling a lot with that. Um, she's a single parent of three kids. Her husband ran off with somebody else and literally just hasn't heard from him in five years. It was a really, really quick thing, just one minute he was there and the next he was gone. So, you know, she was in shock for quite a while and, you know, she was just struggling and she just didn't know what to do with her life. But... She's been struggling every day, but she's been managing to get past. Um, she's been having a lot of troubles before, where she's not been able to pay bills and things like of that sort. But you know, she's been trying to um, help herself out and you know get lots of jobs to try and put things towards that. Now, something that she really likes to do is writing, and she's managed to get into the writing career, finally, which she's been wanting to do for pretty much a whole life. She's been dreaming about that since she was a kid, actually, and now she's in the writing career. She's starting from the bottom, but, you know, um, you know, hopefully she'll get in a good position at some point, and um, she's been good at gaining success from actually writing about her problems. Now, it's something that a lot of people like to hear about. It's very descriptive and things, and, you know, she's actually been selling a lot of copies of these, like, uh, not even, like, books, but, like, just short stories about everything that she's doing, and maybe, like, exaggerating a little bit, but it's still she's getting a lot of money from it which is great so her life has been turning around and it just shows that you know um to other sims <laughs> that um it, you know you can get your life back around pr pretty quickly if you put your mind to it anyway let's get into the outfits that i'm putting on her um also i want you to let me know how like how long do you think create a sim video should be because sometimes i'm like i think this is too long and then sometimes i'm like it's too short and i can't even like say everything i want to say so let me know in the comment section down below just like a, a idea of like how many minutes it should be so i'm thinking maybe three but I'm not exactly too sure anyway let's get back into this so um, I finished the everyday outfit and our makeup on this was like really really like irritating I just couldn't get it right I don't know if it was just the I, I don't even know what it was actually. It was just so hard to do the makeup, and um, but I think I got something. It just didn't really seem to flow and like match very nicely. Again, I don't have any experience with makeup, so I always have a problem when I do female creator sims. And um, so we're onto athletic wear now, and I kind of like I was trying to find a new like top because I like the pants but I couldn't find a top that matched with it so I did end up finding one which was pretty similar at the end and the sleepwear I literally just flew past in like two seconds you probably even see it I don't really spend a lot of time on sleepwear I just don't really think it's an important thing really uh, let me know if you do spend a lot of time on sleepwear because I certainly don't anyway here we are onto the party wear and I can't remember where I got that top from I don't know if it's CC or not it might have been from the luxury party stuff I think that's where it's from I can't exactly remember um so now we're on to the makeup again. I just went back and changed a couple of things. I was like nearing the end of the video and I was like, okay, like what should I change? And I just went back and I was making a couple of changes throughout. I kept going back and forth really. Um, I think something I did was I did all the outfits first and then at the end, <coughs> sorry, my throat. Um, and at the end, I went back and actually did all the accessories and things. I'm actually recording like really early. Well, it's not really early in the morning. It's like 9.30. Um, but still, it's like very early for me to record. I normally do it in the afternoons and evenings. So my voice still, still oh my God, I can't speak like normal <laughs> and my voice still sounds a little bit unusual anyway and um, so like I said we're going back through with the accessories now and if you have any other ideas for future backstories or videos on my channel then you can uh, leave a comment down below with those ideas you can send me a message on YouTube you can send me a message on Twitter there's a link down below to that um, and you can also go on the Sims Amino app or the X Home Sims X Amino app my username on both of those is Thomas and um, those are, if you don't know what Amino is, it's basically like a social network for simmers. Um, well, not Amino is, but you can join sub-communities uh, for a particular interest of the two I am in or for sims. Um, I'm a curator on the Sims Amino app, uh, which basically means a moderator and a leader, with along with Jen on the X Urban Sims X Amino. Anyway, that's it for this video. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, please make sure you leave a like, comment, share and subscribe if you haven't. Let me know down below about what you think and I'll see you all next time. Bye!